So, how does condensed resin work? Uh, well, we're about to find out. So condensed resin is a craftable item that takes these crystal cores, which you get from catching crystal flies, and your actual original resin. Now, it might seem kind of weird, like why would, why would I ever want to craft using my resin? Well, in, in those instances where you're not going to be able to actually sit down and farm out some artifact domains, or you're not going to be able to play for the day, this is a way that you can actually take that resin and pretty much condense it down and save it. And you'll notice that it, it uses 40 resin. So I'm actually just gonna go ahead and craft three of these really quick, just so that we can kind of see what this does. So I'm gonna go ahead and craft those. And now it, it's important to know that you can only carry three at a time. Let's pretend for a minute. Let's pretend to fast forward for an entire day. I really wanna do some extra farming and I've already used up all of the resin that I have for today. Well. We can basically go and complete something that would cost resin and we actually have a way to use it. So now I'm gonna go in and I'm going to do this domain because one, I need the artifacts and two, we're gonna be able to use our condensed resin. Okay, so now that we're done, let's actually run up here and you'll notice whenever we hit the tree. So if we go to use our resin on the petrified tree, you'll see now that it gives us these two options, use original resin or use our condensed resin. So first, just like we normally would, we're gonna use our original resin. And you'll notice this is what it gives us. All right, looks like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pieces, none of which I wanted. Now that we've completed it again, let's actually run up here and we're going to use this time our condensed resin. Now remember, when you craft it, it takes 40 resin. So when we use that, whenever you do the tree, it actually gives you 40 resin worth of artifacts. So you'll see a ton more, a ton more. So what does that mean? Well, this is actually really good because what you could end up doing is actually saving yourself a lot of time. Even if you don't plan to play, you know, that day at all, or even if you only have like a short amount of time and you still need to farm domains, you can just go make condensed resin and then go do the domains to get double the rewards. Now, you can also do it with ley lines. Now, for scientific research purposes, let's test this out. A ton of enemies around me, but uh, you know, we're just gonna work through it. So let's go ahead and hit this. We're gonna use condensed resin. And as you can see, it pops out 13 and seven. Yeah, so it doubles the rewards just like we would expect. I feel like sometimes whenever, you know, you're doing ley lines, you're also wanting to get the drops from the enemies. So why, why would I, it just doesn't seem as efficient to me to use them for ley lines, unless you just legit need those more than anything else. So one and crucial thing is after you defeat one of the bosses, you can't actually use condensed resin for it. It does not work for anything outside of the, the domains and the ley line blossoms. So don't try to, you know, use it on bosses or anything like that. If you don't have the resin to do that straight out of your pocket, don't, don't try it. Personally, I'm gonna use all of mine for farming domains and stuff like that. I feel like it it speeds things up. It's way more efficient in the long run to uh, to speed it up if I needed to for any reason. And not having to do these domains, you know, so many times is is just amazing. But yeah, so that's basically how condensed resin works, guys. If you have any kind of questions, drop them down in the comments below. Uh, that's 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 it. Okay, bye. <laughs>